So now I'm going to show you how to change your Corsair keyboard's lights. So the first thing that you need to do after plugging in your Corsair keyboard is you'll need to download this program. It's called IQ, all right? So ICU, so this app right here, you need to download it. So I'm going to show you how to download it. So open a browser and type in Corsair.com. And when you open Corsair.com, it's going to look like this. And now where you want to go is you'll need to go to support, all right? So click on support and go over download software, click on it. Now, after clicking on that, you'll need to download this one, Corsair IQ, all right? So you'll need to download on this button right here, all right? So one click on it and it will show you this application. You don't have to uh, fill in, so just click on skip right here. So just one click on skip and you will download it, all right, and install it. So I'm not going to download it because I already have. So I'm going to close this, then I'm going to open IQ. So now to open it, you click on start and type in ICUE, IQ, and you open it up, all right. So when you open it up, it will look like this and your keyboard device should appear right here. And this is mine, this is K55 RGB. So you just one click on it, all right? And as you notice, now I have the colors up here. So now these colors are on my keyboard, but I want to change it. So I'm going to click on lighting effects. So now I'm going to change it. You know, on my keyboard, as you notice, it's a static color, but I can click here and go to, you know, choose rainbow if I want, you know? And now it's a rainbow. So is, this is the, the speed of the rainbow and uh, you know, yeah, so you click on it. You want the rainbow to appear wherever you want. So you can click on revert to go back to you know default. Now I'm going to change this to color pulse. So this is a pulse, all right? So it will come and go just like as if somebody is breathing. So now I can change this to alternating. And as you notice, it will alternate between the red and blue, all right? So this is another mode. And there are, you know, a couple of different things that you can choose and play with, all right? Well, this is how you can simply change the colors of the keyboard and I uh, already have shown you guys how to use actions and how to use the G keys all right everyone so don't forget to like and subscribe if you have any questions leave them in the comments below so I'll see you all later I'm out of here